most of this room knows, being loved by Olivia, being Olivia's friend, it's a very special thing. Being Olivia's friend, it's like having a superpower or a secret weapon or a whole army of people at your disposal. She is the most understanding, generous, loyal, resourceful person that I know. Growing up, I always heard that uh, now you're brothers, but when you really grow up, then you'll become best friends. And I never believed it, but I've never been more happy in my life to have been wrong. Because I can say with uh, certainty that you are my best friend and I love you. To say that Paul is a hard worker is an understatement. To say that Paul treats Olivia with kindness and tenderness and love and respect is an understatement. As a father, I couldn't ask for anything more for my daughter. I think that Paul is very blessed to be loved by Olivia and now to be married to Olivia. And I'm so glad that Olivia has found someone who seems to love as fiercely and unconditionally as she does. Olivia, I think you two are perfect for each other ever since you two met. Paul told me like right after you guys met, he's like, I think I'm going to marry this girl. And I believed him, you know, <laughs> I had no reason to doubt it. You two are perfect for each other. You're a great friend and now a, a great sister to me. And I look forward to all the memories that uh, we're going to make together as a family. You know how Judy and I feel about you. We love you. We couldn't be prouder to call you our son-in-law. I would just like to ask everyone here to please raise your glasses. We love you. God bless you. Okay.